Welcome, Echo. Aries. <laughs> Aries, welcome. This is your abundance reading. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Ladies and gentlemen, let's check in and see what is coming up for you guys. So, so Aries, there is a shift of energy. The King of Swords is here, Aries. Some of you Aries were working together on some sort of a team. Some of you Aries are going to be collaborating on some sort of a work. Or if you had collaborated and merged, I see this is not working out. I see some sort of a lawsuit is going to be coming in. So this is a plain straight cut message for you Aries in the season of Capricorn. I want to say thank you for being here. Please like, share, subscribe, put on the notification button and thumbs up before you leave. Thank you um, for returning. This energy um, for you Aries has to do with some sort of a problem with your boss, um, problem with some sort of a network, um, problem with people who you merged with, problems on the work floor, in the team, in the teamwork, team leaders. And this is going to be ending up in some sort of a legal match. So personal officer could be some of you Aries are dealing with some sort of an issue where some sort of a problem. Um, and this is going to be ending up where there is going to be a legal suit that is going to be transpired. Are you going to be winning? Um, it is, uh, um, to look under the number five energies because uh, there is where justice is. Okay. So if some of you had some sort of a legal suit with your company, um, in order to find out what is going to be happening and transpiring, you have to choose one of these energies. What are these energies saying? How does this affect your life? It's about to, you're about to find out what is happening and transpiring. So please be open to the energies. So we're going to be looking and breaking down these energies. This reading is from the 22nd of December until the 19th of January, that is the Capricorn season. So what are we looking at? With the energy of the shoes, you're dealing with your boss or supervisor, but it's someone who is an authority figure. Um, some sort of a problem, some sort of an issue with this man. This man is a Aquarian Gemini or Libran, but some sort of a information is going to be coming out of, um, about this man. Was this the person that was keeping you back and not giving you the pr promotion? Who is this man and why have this man come up in your reading? So this could be a boss or a supervisor that have kept some of you down for a very long time. And now you're having a huge problem. You could be suing your boss or a supervisor. That could be a situation where there was some sort of a um, dishonest play. And I see you could be um, really suing your boss or your supervisor or a company for some sort of a dis. Um, this honest play that was created and this is going to be creating financial stability. A lot of you could be having problems with your boss or supervisor. And what that is doing is basically throwing you off, uh, um, off the, the ground, throwing you off the ship because, um, whatever is transpiring, I see that the stability of, uh, um, where you are at the moment, you need to, um, check out the shoes to find out what direction you need to make okay and this is going to be good then we are looking at the three of pentacles and the energy of the three of pentacles has to do with uh, um a contract okay so the energy of the three of pentacles for your aries have to do with a contract the ring is always about contract now Whatever this contract is that was created or a merger in a contract or people who had collaborated together. So this could be a teamwork. You could be a team supervisor, some sort of a contract where your contract is going to be changing to be a team leader or a supervisor that is coming up and it's in a positive direction. So this is going to be good for a lot of you Aries that you are going to be receiving some sort of a message 
um, the 28, 29, 28 till the third or the 28 till the second that a contract change is going to be coming in that is going to be helping you and is going to be affecting your financial flow. So this is absolutely wonderful for you guys. And especially if you wanted to collaborate or network with other people, a contract is going to be form between you and other people that is going to be creating a lot of uh, prosperity and abundance. So this is going to be good. So line up and get ready for some sort of a new contract that is coming in. If you were looking for a new contract, you are open for some sort of a new contract. Yes, yes, yes. It is going to be coming in and it is going to be showing you up uh, and giving you the the direction to take in order to create this new contract. So this is going to be absolutely fabulous. Then we are looking at the energy with the rose. The energy with the rose have to do with the eight of pentacles. Now the eight of pentacles is coming up in reverse. Let's talk about the reverse and the flip side of the reverse. Now the flip side of this um, is for people who are looking for a new job. So... If you're open and is looking for a new job, um, choose the energy of the rose because the energy of the rose is uh, um, this um, eight of pentacles in the reverse is saying, hey, I'm looking for a new job. Am I going to get it? And it is going to be showing you uh, the direction to take the frequency, the energy, the frequency to take in order to get this new job or receive this new job or create something new for yourself. So it is going to be for the energy of the road is for people who are, who are looking for a new job. And if you're looking for a new job or you're looking for a new opportunity or extra um, financial stability in your world, this is the energy to take because it is going to be aligning you and guiding you in the correct direction to move forward in order to exhilarate yourself and receive um, the financial abundance that you are looking for. So this is going to be good. So let's move forward um, and look at the positive side. Now, if you are in um, already, if you have already are on work, you're going to be having um, more work coming in. So there could be extra hours and extra um, pay that is going to be coming in. OK, so overwork. So if you already have work, there is going to be more hours, extra hours and extra pay out that is going to be coming in for you guys. So it is really clear. I love the message that is coming up for you guys because this is just so powerful. It's clear. It's letting you know what is happening, what is transpiring and how this is basically going to be affecting your world and your life. So um, look out for this. So let's look at the changes that is coming up. So there could be changes in some of your contract. There could be legal bonds. Um, some of you could have sued your um, boss. It is to pick the number five energy to find out uh, um, are you going to be winning this lawsuit. So some of you people who have legal issues with their boss or em employer, employee, choosing number five is going to be letting you know where this is going. Is there going to be a big payout yet or not? Are you going to be winning? So if you notice, justice is in um, upright. So it depends on who you are. It's going to be a, a yes, because justice is in the upright. So if you had sue your boss or um, someone at work or someone sue a company, you are going to be winning and winning big because uh, um, uh, it could be playing out in your energy. Okay, the um, frequency of... Uh, uh, you winning this, it could be, okay, could be. It depends on what sit under the fifth energy. And I have not done them, so I can't say whether it's a yes or no. And this is why this energy and this frequency needs to be used so we can understand ourselves at a better, better um, way, okay? So I don't read what is under um, the symbol until I get these off. Okay, so 
Um, legal issues is going to be coming up for you, Aries. There's no question. Um, a whole lot of you, Aries, are going to be landing in some sort of a legal issue. So be aware of this. Um, it is going to be a profound, um, a very profound, um, um, season for you because this is an earth season, your fire. Um, so this is going to be the beginning of your new solar year that is coming up when it comes on to your financial and, and, and abundancy. So be aware of this, Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. I gotta go. Namaste. Yeah.